Okay, here's a video to show how to put Gary's on the DS file card. Uh, right, I've got all the components here. I've got the, uh, the bit that plugs into the bottom, which you'll need. Uh, the cable and the DS file card. So let's start off putting the DS file card in here. Yeah. Okay, now, you've got to put the, uh, the second part, that bit, into there. So I'll put the camera down while I do that. Yeah. Okay, now you got both of those plugged in. See there and there. Now, when you plug the cable in, you got to run it to a USB slot. That's what a USB slot looks like, in case you're wondering. And there's the hole. So, hold on. Okay, and turn it on. Okay. So turn on. Just tap the screen. I'm going to say F card, so I'll just tap that. And then it will ask you what you want. Sorry, yes. I've got it plugged into a laptop as you can see. Now, to put games on it, you're going to want to click USB mode. So there you go. And then that will come up. There we are on the computer. That will come up. So I'll just click into you about scanning. And that's it. Now, I've already done this one, uh, just in, yeah, to save time on that. So I've put Advanced Wars Draw Strike on there. Uh, imagine that's your disc with all your games and stuff on it. Here. Yeah. All you do is you just drag them across and wait for them to finish. And then go to computer. And then go to your computer, find out which one it is. And I always get a safely removed just in case because I've had one of these break on me before by uh, just unplugging it when it hasn't finished doing all its stuff. And now it says it's safe, so you can unplug it. Turn it off. No, it's easy if you just unplug that. And turn it back on. And now, you'll go straight to the menu with all your games on. Obviously, I've only put one on. There you go. You can see. Advanced Wars Dual Strike, and there it is. So, if you want to tap it, And you see it'll work. There we go. Da da da. So you can do whatever you want. Yeah. Oh, so, oh yeah, it's the full game. Isn't it? Now, if you want to take games off it, you uh, you do the exact same thing, but instead of dragging them across from there, you drag them. Oh, you uh, you click them. Imagine that's on the uh, on the card that you're plugging there. You click them and just go and press delete. Oh my, it there? And it will delete them off the card. Now you'll be able to swap games or yeah, take games off and that. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's it. That's it.